Hi, I'm Don Bodan from SampleLibraryReview.com, and I'm very excited. Today, we're taking a look at Digital Sensation Volume 2 by UVI. Rolling back the clock on the dawn of digital synthesis, UVI adds another chapter to their digital sensation instruments, this time showcasing some of the classic gear and one very misunderstood synth. Forget your floppies and tiny LCD screens. UVI has sampled these synths with their former glory and all the advantages of software instruments. Library's download is just over 18 gigabytes, contains three separate synth instruments, a total of 528 presets. You've got the DK5S, which is sampled from Kawai K5000S, the DS890, that's from the Roland JD800 and JD990, and the DZMO from the Ensonic Fizmo. It will require the UVI workstation, which is free. You can pick that up, or you could run in Falcon instruments sell for 149 US dollars. At the time of putting together the review here, it was on a special intro price for $99 till May 7th, 2017. For the review here, I teamed up with editor Brian Brylow, who wrote the full written review. I'll be sure to include a link to that in the description below. first one in this pack here is the DK5S. The hardware for the synth was criticized because the controls were confusing, kind of like trying to drive the space shuttle. One of the most notable things about this synth is the additive synthesis with PCM waveforms. Contributor Brian Brylow's review, he goes on to say that the presets here are pretty standard stock workstation presets, but there's some additional creativity UVI have added for the additional presets. All three of the instruments share a basic kind of layout. There's just a little slight change in layout and color to more realistically replicate the interface. For the next instrument here, the DZ Mo, this is sampled from one of the most misunderstood synths in history. With a metallic flake gradient, I'm sure that scared away some of the synth purists. The exciting thing about this instrument here is it uses a synthesis technique called Transwave, and it garnered a reputation for creating some very strange noises. Now, the last instrument here is the DS-890. Sampled from Roland's JD-800 and JD-990, which by far is the most popular of the three. Now the hardware these three instruments are from here, this is a whole a generation of sounds from Tangerine Dreams, Pet Shop Boys, Vangelis, Kraftwerk, Genesis, and many, many more. Now, if you're too young to remember it, um, there was a lot of digital synth innovation in the 90s, but synths were so expensive to get if you weren't a professional musician. Now, there's very few cons in this collection here. You either love the sounds and you're going to be able to use it with all the or power of the original instruments, plus the multis and the software making this a really delicious collection. Be sure to check out the full written review from contributor Brian Brylow. I'll be sure to include a link in the description below where you can listen to the demos, which I uh, was a big fan of, as well as see the official videos or any other review of videos we find across the web. Mm -hmm.
Love to hear your thoughts. Um, are you craving more vintage synths sampled into instruments? Please comment in the description below. Like, share, and subscribe. We'd love your support. Be sure to head over to samplelibraryreview.com for all the latest news and reviews. Thank you.